All right, so here's your dropper housing. It's coming out the right side of your head tube, going around over to right about here where our lever is, the dropper lever. So looking pretty good. It's not coming conflicting with any other cables. We're not intertwining. We're not becoming a big spaghetti mess. So it has its own nice routing right here. And you do want that little nice curvature because when you turn your bars, you want to make sure that you have enough length. This is going to pull on it. You can always uh, go back and reference uh, the derailleur housing adjustment front. That's the dropper line right here. Got a pretty good curve right here coming out and around. Um, we definitely can trim some off. If we don't want this to loop out so much, we could probably push it back in going up the seat tube and right about there. So kind of as a, as a guide rule, we pretend there's a flat ruler right here and we have nothing kind of protruding out this way, just basically a flat wall. So things are looking good. Nothing's coming past this front brake hose right here. Um, so I think this should be enough material. So when we do turn uh, to the right, there's gonna be enough line where it's not gonna pull the cable. That should be good right there. So it's looking pretty good.